So for a prehistory unit, mm -hmm. um, we're going to be spending a little bit of time working on geology. Um, it, it should have been last week because this is when we were, that was when we were learning about the formation of the earth, but um, these just came in the mail today. So um, we're going to spend probably a few days working through um, some geology stuff, also um, learning about the formation of fossils, so it, it'll kind of work. Um, we got this awesome book uh, by Garrett Romaine called Geology Lab for Kids. And it's got some really awesome project, um, projects in it I wanted to show you. Um, and they're separated in a really nice way. So um, there's a whole thing on identifying rocks and crystals, rocks and minerals. Let's see here. Where's the? Here we go. This, the table of contents. So, um, it starts with singular crystals, crystal clusters, specimens, um, lava, sediment, um, which gets oh. into um, sedimentary rocks, metamorphic rocks, breaking it down so that um, uh, that's more sedimentary stuff. Understanding Earth signs of life. Prospecting for riches, space rocks, and rocks of art. So, I really like, I really like how it's separated by, um, kind of by subject within the subject. So take a look at some of this cool stuff in here. And all this stuff is, um, it seems to be pretty much, um, like household items. There's not a bunch of obscure stuff that you need to get. Geodes, we're gonna make geodes for sure. Scratch test. The This book fits so perfectly with these kits. Um, this kit right here, the mineral science, it comes with a streak plate, um, a nail to test for hardness and a little magnifier. Uh, now this is to test the hardness um, and the the streak color so that you can identify what minerals there are and then you can go right in here and um, read over this this one and it also has uh, like I just showed you a second ago the um, the mineral identification so I really, really like this one, sediment science, and it has this whole section down here um, as to the why, the scientific reason behind what this, um, you know, experiment is for. So this is a really fun book. It, there's a series actually, um, and I also got the astronomy lab for kids, which looks great. We will do some of that during. Um, uh, when we study ancient Greece. So it's got um, animation lab for kids, art lab for kids, astronomy, clay, um, energy lab, gardening, kitchen, math, outdoor, paint, and Minecraft. Ooh, those look like a lot of fun. I kind of want to get all of them. Um, now that I see how much I like this one, I kind of want to get the rest of them. But let's take a look now at these um, rock science kits. Um, so let's start with the mineral kit. We were just having a lot of fun with this one. We actually did a, a lab at um, the local um, mineral museum um, that did a project just like this. So, okay, we've got um, a bunch of different samples, and here's a little mineral identification key. Um, we've got fluorite, feldspar, hematite, pyrite, quartz, calcite. Um, and so on and so forth. These little kits are really cool. It um, it breaks it down really, really nicely. There's um, a small pamphlet with a little bit of information in each one, uh, but I definitely suggest these. And these are by Toysmith. So here's the rock science kit. Okay, so this one. This one is nice. It's separated by um, the different kinds of rocks. So igneous rocks, sedimentary rocks, and metamorphic rocks. And we are going to be learning about each type of rock and how each one is formed. 
So this is going to be perfect. What I'll do is I'll mix them up and I'll let them try to figure out what's what. Um, cool. So it shows how to identify rocks. And then you can go outside once you learn this stuff. You can go outside and kind of try to do it on the go. Again, it has your little identification key. Super cool. Oh my gosh. These are really cute. And these specimens are very nice too. I mean, they're all numbered. These are great. Great, great fun for the kids. All right, I hope you enjoyed this quick um, little review of these products. Um, I will go ahead and link the information for these things down in the comments. And if you're interested, go take a look. If you like what you saw here, please um, subscribe to my channel. Go ahead and leave a comment down in the comment section if this is something that you have used before or maybe plan on using or even if you have something that would go along with this I'd love to see what you guys use all right thanks a lot bye bye Ooh, so what color is the screen it's pink pink Look, it's white. It's turning white again. Yeah. So, what is that white stuff? That's the streak color. Oh, it's so clear right here. Oh, look at that one get scratched pretty easily. I think that's the most hardness of 5.5, so it's a great in the middle. Whoa. Good. Now see if you can make a streak on the streak plate. Okay. I wonder what color it's going to be. What do you think? Whoa. Wow, it turns cool. around like poopsies. <laughs> nope.